Elon Musk's kids' thoughts about their dad. Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel Fortune Focus. Let's dive into the video to know what Elon Musk's kids think about their dad. We're talking about Elon Musk, a man who doesn't reveal much about his personal life. But the question that comes to mind is simply, what does six kids think of him on a global scale? Wait a minute, let's make it five since there may still be a younger one Ash, who is too young to comment on his rich father. On the other side, we have his first children, the twins Griffith and Xavier, who are now 17 years old, followed by his second group of children, Kai Saxon and Damien, who are triplets and are 15 years old. Musk clearly described what his adolescents thought of him in a 2014 interview at Washington, D.C. Export Import Financial Institutions Convention, Washington, D.C. They noticed that they don't appear to be excessively enthusiastic about these things. His twins were more than 10 years old at the time, while his triplets were more than seven. Although Must often fantasizes about being a cool parent, he says that it is one of the most difficult things for him to do. For starters, they don't appear to be interested in some of the exciting gigs. He loves to walk with SpaceX and Tesla. He took them to the Tesla factory before they were young adults in the hopes that they would be astounded by all of the advanced technology around them. But to his surprise, his children were not as enthralled by the fact that Musk had thought that they would be. The construction unit was completed 20 occurrences earlier than a parent. Musk even quips that he prefers his inventions to his children. Musk also concedes in the interview that his children could play video games with him instead of spending every second sitting at a Tesla or SpaceX production factory. What are his children's opinions of him now? One thing is certain. They are grown enough to grasp the impact of energy and their father's responsibility. To begin with, Elon Musk does not have a daily painting routine. Due to his tremendous duties, he is renowned for spending 22-hour shifts or falling asleep on the sofa at work at his Tesla production unit. He will not have as much time to spend with his children as other parents do. He can't simply take them to watch a movie or relax without the media following him around but Musk has the money to purchase a whole stadium for himself and pay him. Teens Fortunately, Elon Musk is not the type of arrogant, egotistical, rich thinker who likes to flaunt his money, as his children can attest. He has openly acknowledged in interviews several times that his sole genuine passion is his children, and it shows how they see him as a responsible, caring parent. Even while he no longer wanders through SpaceX, Tesla, and Neuralink, he continuously meets with the men. Musk's children are also aware of their father's huge money as the primary technology of one of the world's richest children. To be honest, he has lived in luxury beyond our wildest expectations. Musk revealed in a 2017 interview with Rolling Stone magazine that he had one of the most miserable childhoods and that his father became capable of awful things. He characterized his father as a horrible person a listless, someone who planned horrible ideas. Musk recounts his father verbally assaulting him as he discloses more about his early years. Elam decided to come to Canada as a student with various aspirations and dreams, and he frequently failed to admit that he had no religion in his career. His father strongly cautioned him that he might be in South Africa with his tail between his knees in a matter of months. Musk also discusses how his father often labeled him an idiot but in the end, Musk proved him wrong by founding some of the world's most profitable enterprises, making him one of the wealthiest people on the planet. On the other hand, Errol Musk had some very strong replies to his son's accusations, even when questioned by the Daily Mail. He encouraged his kid to mature and refrain from labeling him as wicked. He wants to recover from himself, so he will not always strike his lower back. He will participate until he uses his senses. He's throwing a temper tantrum like a spoiled child. He can't get what he wants. Therefore, he's turned into a nasty monster from the outside. Perhaps Musk would try to make amends for his formative years' horrors by pampering his personal kids. He is now six foot one and has grown very little throughout his apprenticeship years at the center. He is frequently teased, and one of the attacks is so violent that his nose is disfigured. The damage increased as he grew older and he had to stabilize it in 2013 due to respiratory issues, but his children are growing entirely differently today. Remember how his children, with the assistance of the kings, 
Kim connected with the prince and princess of Monaco while they were as young as possible. Musk's sons treated the situation with indifference, if not comfort. It is obvious that this will become a reality for your children. Because they were born into them, they were accustomed to touching the pleasant things that exist. So Musk sat about expanding both his horizon and his personality. You don't need them to become rich, spoiled brats incapable of being responsible if you're a caring parent. He will create a space in his home. One specific restriction he has enacted in his family is that his children must study twice as many books due to the wide variety of computer games they play. While they are listing these video games, they must not play video games as we do. He destroyed his brain cells because of how he was positioned. He once discovered playing an internet game in which the most successful concept in sports was to tap on a cookie. That's all. Stay tuned and subscribe for more.